Hi guys, this is Diane here from Design Creative and I just want to say a big happy new year and happy holidays to all of us. It is 2015, which only means, well, nothing really apart from that, it's the beginning of a new year. Um, so yeah, this um, video today is really simple. First of all, um, before I start with the video I just want to thank everybody who's watched the series that we did last year um, it was super fun to do I had lots of people email me um, and contact me directly to basically tell me how much they enjoyed the video and um, I've had a couple of people ask me to do one-on-one -on -one sessions with them so if you guys are interested in at any point to do one-on-one -on -one sessions so then I can help you with your own website then more than happy to help you just give me an email let me know what you want to do and I will be there waiting um, I did get a couple of requests to do other videos and I'm hoping to do them this year. Well, I'm hoping to do them really soon to be honest. So if you've got any requests for videos, let me know in the comment section below and I'll pick and choose which ones that I like. So um, first of all, one of the major things that I got requested for was um, a little app that I used in... Um, my video and it's an app that allows you to see your website at different widths um, at different uh, viewpoints um, so if you're looking at it from a mobile it would like you know resize your browser to that and I got so many I think that was like my number one question what is that app what is that app so I'm going to show you in this video today exactly what that app is it is a um, a bookmarklet or something that you could basically install into your bookmark uh, bar and you literally press it and it will give you different options but I'm gonna go for those options in a second it's from this guy called multi uh, Wazerman. I'm not even sure whether I've said his name right I probably said it completely wrong but I'm really really sorry if I have and he's created this bookmark that you can use I think you could use it in Firefox I don't know whether there's an Internet Explorer version but there's definitely might be a Firefox version and there definitely is a Chrome version because that's the version that I use Safari and all the rest of them I don't know whether they have um, the bookmark for it but I definitely you know it's in uh, in in Chrome so um, it's very easy to use you literally just go onto the website and you drag this thing up to your bookmark um, bar and whenever you need to use it you just press resize that and then it would resize your browser automatically now um, if let me go to my own website and I'm gonna press the resizer button so we can see what it does so automatically it brings up this bar above my website okay so this is an iframe at the moment and what you need to do is you just need to click on any of the buttons here and then it resizes it really simply um, so I can get to see what this website looks on you know different um, different platforms so here it says small tablet so this is 600 by 800 pixels and that is the um, the portrait view if we can click it so it looks uh, landscape and again we can have a look and see what we've got here we can go smaller if we want to and as you can see as my website goes smaller my website is responsive as well so um, what you can also do is there's this little button up here called animate you can press this button and it slowly resizes it for you um, I just hope that it's going to look pretty as it does it because I haven't actually used it um, for my website but it doesn't really matter um, and you can add your own you can stop it by just pressing animate again you can add like your own um, sizes as well so I can press customize and type in some you know some random number and it would come up with that as well it's very easy to come out of as well there's this um, box here this um, uh, cross uh, sorry I'm, I'm looking at my goldfish at the same time they're making a lot of noise in their tank at the moment sorry about that so um, it's very easy to use and it's a very easy bookmarklet to install onto your 
uh, browser you can as well build your own bookmarks if you're not happy with the options that you have here you can so here we've got one two three four five six different options that we can press and it will come up with different sizes but we can create our own ones so um, we can choose which ones we want by just clicking on the um, tabs here once they're highlighted it means that they've all gone into, into this results editor box here I'm gonna click a few more I'm gonna go into the tablet section we can click for Samsung Galaxy the um, Kindle Fire the Apple iPad HP touchpad so we can add all of this and then once we've added all of this inside our results editor we can literally drag this one up and plop it there now if we go into back to my website and I click this last resizer it should hopefully as you can see come up with a whole list of brand new ones as well that I can use okay and you can see that if I hover over this one which is the Apple um, iPhone it tells me exactly what browser it is so here it says Apple iPhone um, if I click on this one this is the iPhone 5 if I click on this one it's the iPod touch if I click on this one this is the Amazon Kindle Fire okay so it's a really great bookmark clip to have um, I would definitely recommend downloading it um, if you're a Chrome user and if you can down download it oh here here you see browser support so it's on Chrome it's on Firefox it's on Oprah Opera and it's on this on Oprah <laughs> yeah that'd be funny it's on uh, and it's on Safari so any of these which are your favorites make sure that you um, download it to your browser and have fun so now you can be able to figure out your media queries and you don't have to sit there and try to literally resize the browser which is a bloody headache sometimes you could just press this little button and um, you have all of your different um, ways to see the website there and the great thing about this as well is you can still use your um, inspect element so I can still use firebug down here to kind of figure out what elements are what which is super super handy so sorry about all the ums and ahs I haven't done a video for a little while I've been super busy trying to get clients works out of the way but I'm hoping to do more videos for you um, next well not next year this year more videos this year so um yeah make sure that you leave a comment below um if you want to know any i think i might do some more videos like just random 10 minute videos about plugins that i really like um I know I did a couple last year, but I think I want to make a feature out of it because I get some really, I, I find some really, really great plugins, and um, I only kind of share it within my um, within my network. But um, what I do want to say as well is I've created. If you're a Headway Themes user, I have created. Um, let me see. Do, 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 do. Let me bring this down for you so I could show you. I have created a Headway Themes user group. Okay, so if you're a Headway Themes user, make sure that you pop over to the group. I will um, uh, I will add you to the group. And if you've got any questions, just you know, let the group know and we'll be more than happy to help. So I'm glad that you've uh, listened to this video with all the ums and the ahs in it. And hopefully I will see you in the next video.